transported to another century by Timex mysterious time top, Brick and Sandy seek an ancient formula supposedly buried with pirate gold. They're attacked by ferocious natives who mistake them for pirates and... Ancient Depoy Camion. time I shipped us back here just to entertain a bunch of natives. I'm going to be plenty burned up. You mean barbecued. Why? Did you see what I saw? Yeah, Wolf. We got other things to worry about. See those two men tied up over there? Yeah. What have they got against us? Can't you tell them it's all a mistake? Well, they think we're pirates, we don't know their language. He boys us how to tie, don't they? Looks like we're really goners this time. Yeah. Maybe not. Got your cigarette lighter? What well, for? Is there enough fire now? Try to burn the rope from your wrist. Oh. Hey, I, I can't reach it. It's in my hip pocket. You try it. Doctor makes strong medicine. White man lie. No have strong medicine. White witch doctor holds magic fire in hand. That'll be good, Sandy. close for comfort. Did you happen to notice the other prisoners? The two yeah. guys they had tied up? Yeah. Hey, they look like sailors. Maybe pirates. Mm -hmm. They might know something about the treasure. Well, when do we start again? First, let's get some equipment from the time top. You know the sort of stuff that'll play on the imagination of the natives? Yeah. yeah. Say, I'll be an even bigger medicine man. Sure. seem to have any callers, unless they're waiting for us inside. Oh, after you. Look, I can use this as a medicine bag. Hey, hey, Brick. Hey, 
take it easy. What's your hurry? Look before you leap, remember? And don't forget, he who hesitates is lost. He'll... I can't win. What are you stopping here for? I'm tired. But we haven't even started yet. Well, maybe I'm anemic. You know, Brick, it's really great here. Mm -hmm. So quiet, no traffic problems, don't have to duck any automobile. Say, why don't you try some of your magic? There'd never be a better time or a worse performance. I'm not in the mood. Anyway, I can't find my knapsack. Hey, look, why don't you dare him to come out in the open? You know, man to man, I'll referee. Mm -hmm. You stay here. Are you kidding? side of that clearing. I gotta get those two men loose before the natives kill them. What'll I do? Anything. Anything. Yes, anything. Great. Now get going. Pardon me. Opportunity knock only once. You come here right now, Prado, or white medicine man, sizzle you good. White magician got nice presents for Big Chief. Yeah. Nothing to worry about. Huh? <laughs> See? <laughs> mm. Gosh, 
Rick. I thought another was going to find you. Well, there was no way to signal you without giving our position away to the natives. Sandy, this is Stevens and Rourke. Oh, hi. Uh, say, uh, are you two fellows of pirates? We are sailormen, lads. But let it go at that. Say, what kind of trickery? What did you pull with them savages? Trickery? Mm -hmm. You might call that a 20th century gag. I guess it seems pretty strange to you 18th century guys. Don't... What's this talk of 20th century? He means his tricks are a little bit ahead of time. Uh, shall we move on? We better get back to Tuttle. He's our shipmate. We didn't leave him far from here. Want to come along? Let's go. It's my thought Tuttle's gone after the treasure alone. Treasure? What treasure? Well, the same one we're after, Brick. After treasure, then, are you? Oh, no, no, just a little piece of paper with some worthless figures on it. It's supposed to be in a treasure left here by Captain Y some years ago. He speaks of our old skipper. And you want no gold, eh? Uh, well, let's find Tuttle first, and we'll argue about the gold later, huh? He's right about that. It's plain to see which way he took. Looks like your pals ran out on us and took the girl with them. They no doubt mean to question her about the treasure. About Captain Wise's treasure? And you know, eh? Yeah. You may speak freely. Well, Rourke and Stevens think Lulu knows where the treasure is because she was old Wise's sweetheart. They mean to cut me out of the gold. Didn't you figure on cutting them out? That was different. Yes, that's what I thought. Give me a hand with my pal. We gotta get out of here. Come on, come on, Sandy. Snap out of it. Now we gotta look for his pals. Yeah. Oh, brother, they should have booked you in a garden. Garden? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Come on, you feel all right? We know Captain Wyatt told you where he buried the gold. Lula, no tell you. Lula want to keep on living. You kill me, never find gold. There they are. There should be some way to work this out without fighting. Him hurt Lula. She just wants you to kill each other, can't you see? I'll leave her out of this. It's between him and me. There should be plenty of gold for all. Enough for you three and for Lula. Now, Sandy and I don't want any of the treasure. All we want is the paper I told you about. Now, why don't we stick together on this? If we don't, the natives will finish us. He talks sense, mate. Yeah. We can get the she cat to talk. Well, Lula, going to show us where the treasure is? Or would you rather chance outsmarting the lot of us? You white medicine man, no? Me white medicine man, yes. You have magic firebox? <laughs> I sure have. Lula, show where it's gold, if Lula can have. Well, now, I don't know about this. I've gotten very oh, attached. Lula. Lula can have. Oh, now, wait a minute, Brick. This slider happened to save you our life. the rest of your life here? Yeah. Now, Lula, will you show us what the treasure is? Now, look, 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 wait a minute. There, yeah, very simple. Have fun. Lula show. Hey, the sacrifices I make for science. 
is this that flies through space? What will happen here without Brick and Sandy to help? For the stirring answers, see Trapped in the Time Top, Chapter 9 of Brick Bradford, this theater next week.